Hey guys, it's Friday um, afternoon. I'm actually about to pick up Noel in a little while. I am so happy because, like, when I pick up Noel, I'm going to the mall to return um, something to BB that I got a while ago. Um, so I have to go return it. So I told my aunt, I'm like, look, I'm going to the mall, you know. Have to return some stuff do you want to come and she's like yeah let's go and like she's coming with me and i don't know i'm, I'm so excited because like my mom if i would wait for her to get home like to go then it's always a thing like you can never just be like hey i'm going to the mall you want to come she's always like i'm tired i work all day da -da -da. we'll go tomorrow i gotta do this i gotta do that and my aunt is just like yeah let's go and it's i don't know i have company and stuff so i'm excited um for that uh, some other stuff I had to tell you guys, but I'll tell you later because I'm gonna go. It's officially summer. The humidity is crazy, so I just washed my hair, so I'm gonna go, um, diffuse it now. Um, and just leave it curly, because I can't, <laughs> it's like the fight against humidity. Um, it's just not worth the fight, so I'm not even gonna bother straightening my hair. You guys are gonna see. Well, you know, if you like know me for a while or know me for real for real I don't know whatever but in the summertime my hair is like 90% of the time I just leave it natural curls um so we're back to that weather uh what else did I want to tell you guys oh this morning I was speaking with like one of my mom's friends like a family friend for a long time um and we were she gave me a lot of insight on stuff so um if I remember I'll tell you guys about that later like relationship stuff and like life stuff like that um so yeah let me go diffuse my hair and get ready to go and i'll see you guys later on inside the compost i just we just did um a science experiment because i signed him up for the young scientist club so every month he's gonna get a science kit to the house Yay! for like four years or so so um we just got kit number one and we're doing an experiment about all about recycling is this kit right Yes. So what did we do? It's Saturday, Sunday morning, by the way, guys. Um, what did we do with the experiment? We were putting uh, water and the dirt, and we were taking off the dirt, the cover from the dirt, and we were putting the little brown thing in the dirt inside the cup with the water, and then now. We put some apples inside. Inside what? Where do we put the apples? Grandma! Why did you dump that in there? Porque esto es compost. But Grandma! That's dry food! Yeah, we have I... to recycle food now. But oh. I want that cup! Hi, Mom. Okay, yo te doy otro. Okay. Say hi. But... Hi. I don't know. Uh, so the internet. That's look I gotta do your hair. Ah! <laughs> She's gonna attack me. <laughs> Take that out of your mouth. Take that out. <laughs> no, Noel, stop. Noel, calma, calma. Noel. Noel, finish telling them. Come here. Oh, crazy. Me, 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 finish me, telling me. them. Where did we put the apples? Like the the apple peel. Inside. Inside what? The dirt. Mm -hmm. today. We put only apple, apple peels? Yes. And what did we put in the other one? A piece of bag. So what do you think is going to happen? To the bag? Yeah. It's, it's just going to be a bag. And it's then? It's going to be a bag still. Because and only the apples will turn into compost. Because espectacular, el que me hiciste comprar esa. Yeah, ¿te gusta? Probalo, Mirta. The, the, the body scrubs from Bath and Body Works. Ah. The body scrubs from Bath, the exfoliating oh, no. body washes. Te saca, ajá. Uh -huh. Te saca, sentís como te saca. Y es muy, suave, ¿no? Muy, muy, muy duro. Yeah. 
El, Ahí está el, el, el rosado el, al lado de los no? al lado de el los rosado shampoo. que está adentro es, es uno también, pero de diferente olor, si lo quieres usar el otro. Ah, olor. bueno, chico, igual ahora dije, puse ese yeah. cuando terminamos uno. Pero no, no, cuando no. vas. So, hey guys, I'm here with Risa and song. she is doing a vlog every single day of and summer. I'm doing a vlog and she's doing a vlog. Like take a vlog. Hey. Um and I'm doing this. I'm here too. Hello. Hi guys! And we're going to Vegas in September for my pre-birthday bash. And we're here planning it out like crazy. What's your birthday? My birthday is the 14th. So we're going literally the 3rd to the 7th. planning her birthday party. So I told you guys that I'm vlogging every single day this summer. I don't know, something like that. Yeah. And she just dropped her fucking camera. See you guys later. Oh, and we're in Studio Square, by the way, but nobody's sitting down there because it literally rained for five seconds to wet everything and then it stopped raining. Wong, wong. I just left my car in the mechanic. I'm so sad. Wong, wong. I'm gonna vlog her vlogging so that I don't have to vlog. But Reese is here. Hi. We're going to pick up Noah from school. We just did a collab. Um, we did 50 random questions on my channel and we did a whole bunch of sex questions on her channel. Sexy time. Her video is gonna be so much better, but I can't post that on my channel. I'm, I'm so tight. I'm excited. I can't wait to see her video. Tomorrow? Yeah. Tomorrow. No, tomorrow, tomorrow, like 12 o'clock. Yeah, I'll edit. I'll edit it right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> it's so hot. Oh my god, it's, it's so very hot. humid today. I'm like dying. Can we um? Or should we wait till I come back from Florida to start this Vegas countdown? When are you coming back to Florida? I don't know. We're going to Vegas. We're I know. Vegas. I can't wait. <laughs> I just want to go away from New York forever and never, ever, ever come back. And never pay. Do never you know pay. That's a pussy willow? A, what's a pussy willow? That's tree right here. Oh, that's a pussy willow. Okay. Well then. Your sister has them in Canada. Your sister has pussy willows? Yes, sister has pussy willows. <laughs> Sounds so gross. Yo! Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, it's up a hill, sorry. <laughs> Work those thunder thighs out, girl. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Oh, so I Vegas can find body. My, uh, my personal trainer. You have a personal trainer? Why do I not have a personal trainer? He lives on Farmer's Boulevard. He's like, it's not far from me. And it's like $200 for six sessions and $300 oh, yeah. for 12 sessions. Oh. And like people like get really fit in like 10 sessions and because I'm not that big, Far. like I'll get I it. wanna do it. You wanna All do right. it with me? Bye guys. Hey guys. Alright, so it's Tuesday or is it Monday? I hope it's not Monday. I'm so over this week already. It's Tuesday. It's Tuesday, June 23rd. Um you guys saw Risa was over earlier. We did some tag videos together. And while I had her here, because me and her are planning to go to Vegas. Okay, so there was like this whole thing. Um, I was going to go to Costa Rica in September or uh, in September for my birthday. But then my aunt is staying until September 16th. My birthday is the 14th, so she can spend my birthday with us. So then I'm like, great, well, I can't go away for my birthday if she's only staying that long for my birthday. So I'm like, all right. Um... Then I was going to go to Izu here in New York City um, Labor Day weekend, but then there was a thing with that, and I'm like, uh, no, I'm not going, because um, somebody's going to be there that I don't want to go. Um, so then I'm like, all right, well, great. Costa Rica is fucked. Izu's fucked. Like, what the hell is going on right now? So we're going to Vegas instead um, for Labor Day weekend, and it's going to be my pre-birthday celebration, and... Um, it actually came up, somebody was talking at it about it at like an event or something recently and then it was going to be like this YouTube thing and then of course, you know how everybody is that they say things and they never go through with it and I'm just like, whatever. So Risa seemed like she was really down. So today while I had her here filming, I'm like, we're going to check this stuff out right now and literally we checked it out and I'm like, let's book it. <laughs> I'm like, I will pay because I just got paid yesterday. I said, I'll pay the whole thing now so we have it booked and then you give me your half when you get paid. And she was like, okay. So I booked it and now she's locked and loaded and she's got no way of getting herself out of this. So I have my little partner in crime for Vegas. I'm so freaking excited. You guys, Vegas has been on my bucket list for years and years and years and years and years. Um, 
I did my summer bucket list and I put it in my, there's like a lot of things. I didn't even count them, but there's a lot on there. Oh, there's my tutu for day glow. Day glow's on Sunday, this Sunday. Um, so I made a tutu to wear over there. Um, and yeah, so anyway, I did my bucket list, um, for all the things I want to do this summer and I put it in my scrapbook. I did it really cute. I'll show you guys later. Um, and yeah, and I've been dying to go to Vegas like my entire life. You don't understand. I grew up with older brothers. So it was like, I don't know. I would always be like, this little ass girl at home, like, eight years old, or, yeah, I guess, like, eight I was, when I started, like, really noticing that they would, like, especially one of the two, like, one of him, one of my two brothers was, like, this party animal, so it was, like, he would literally, like, you know, take a shower, get ready, put on all, like, this cool ass clothing, and, like, a million layers of cologne and he would like walk out of his room out the door and like it would leave a trail of smelling cologne and he would like go rave all night and shit and like I don't know and it was just the coolest thing ever and I was always like so envious of my brothers I'm like when I grow up I'm gonna do that too I'm gonna go out I'm gonna party and I'm gonna rave so I kind of grew up with that and then when I was finally old enough I'm like Yes, bitch, yes. Um, so I started, you know, doing all the things that I saw my brothers do or my brother that I always wanted to do, but he would go to Vegas all the time. Um, and I just never could, like I never really could afford it. So I guess a lot of the things I didn't do was because um I couldn't afford it. And now I'm just like I need to like do things that I wanted to do. Like I need to start doing my bucket list. So one thing down, um, we're gonna go to Vegas for Labor Day weekend. I'm so excited. And then, um, I was talking to one of my friends, like, really randomly. We talk, we, we talk every once in a while, like, to keep up and stuff. Mommy, and where's my Game Boy? I don't know. Where'd you put it this morning? You were playing with it. Um, so yeah, what the hell was I saying? Oh yeah, so we were talking, and I'm like, oh, hey, how are you, whatever, and randomly he's like, I'm going to Vegas for Labor Day week, and I was like, shut the fuck up. I was like, yeah, right, so am I, oh my god, whatever. He's like, yeah, it's gonna be my first time. I'm like, this could be my first time, too. So we just, like, <laughs> freaking bonded off of that right now. Like, this was a couple of days ago, so literally he's been hitting me up. Like, we, we're friends, we just don't talk often, we talk every once in a while, but now he's been hitting me up, like, every day and we're like super excited and we've been talking about it and I hadn't even booked yet like it was just like it just started off I said like as a YouTube girl's idea and then everybody started flaking and then um whatever and then when I found out he was going I was like oh my god you know we're gonna have a little crew over there and I was such a loser and then my other friend that used to live in New York he's a promoter he moved over there and now he's a promoter over there so I just remembered him today I'm like let me hit this nigga up too and see like if he's still over there and what's going on and I don't know I'm just like so excited I'm like I got plans already I got my itinerary already because I'm so OCD um this is crazy so we booked today and I'm freaking over the moon happy um and then like something happened today that was absolutely amazing so I'm very thankful to God for that um well plus booking the trip okay well the trip wasn't as expensive as I thought it was gonna be I thought it was gonna be like thousands of dollars or whatever but it was like well under a thousand dollars a couple of hundred dollars under a thousand dollars and then literally within a couple of hours of me having booked it I, I don't secured know where it is. When you're done with that, can you find it? Yes. I um got a job for like the exact amount almost that I spent. Like nine dollars more than how much I spent. So basically God was like, You're supposed to be going to Vegas. Here is like it's my gift to you. He reimbursed me my money. So that was absolutely amazing. Um <laughs> I'm not, You're so silly. I'm not doing nothing. My mother, Risa was still over my house when my mother got home, so she was being just really obnoxious, like screaming, can we go, can we go? Because we were going to go to Target, like, I'm not waiting longer, I'm not going to take you later. Like, it, it makes people feel mad uncomfortable, so that was embarrassing. Then when my mom found out that I just booked for Vegas, then apparently, she, not apparently, then all of a sudden she was like, on super bitch mode and I like I got mad and after a while I'm like bro you're like you're just acting up because you're jealous that I'm going to Vegas that's not cute what's wrong with you and she got really mad that I said that but I think it was true whatever so bottom line is 
I booked my trip to Vegas today. I'm freaking excited. I cannot wait. And I'm on a super diet from now until then. And yeah, I just wanted to update you guys because I know I've been like really not into the vlogging anymore. Um, but whatever. What else today? I don't know. Today was just a really weird day. Like that whole Vegas thing was like amazing. And then everything else was just really weird. And I have like a really bad presentimiento about concerning something like all day today. I don't know. And it's bothering me. Whatever. All right, guys. So I will, I don't know, see you next time I vlog. Tomorrow's Noel's graduation, so I'll probably vlog that.